Now, Fazana actually didn't know that I'm actually doing a speech for her tonight, so this is a bit of a surprise for her. And firstly, and Papi didn't actually know either, so firstly, this is a bit of a, it's an honour to be part of Patrick's and Fazana's special day. My little sister's all grown up, and I'm so proud to be part of a special day. She's getting married, yay. Um, well, no, no, she's not getting married. She's actually married, isn't she? Yeah, that's right. Um, it seems just like yesterday that we were sleeping in our bunk beds in Mum's house, and me, of course, on the top because the the most um, what do you call it? The most um, important, important, or the most special person gets the top bunk, right? Yeah, or the yeah. So. I remember getting so frustrated with Fazana for snoring so, so loudly, night after night after night, and this went on for 10 years, right? So Patrick, honestly, I feel so sorry for you. And I really hope she finally gets her tonsils removed so you can have a good night's sleep, okay? So being the older sister, you know, being the clever one, I always get the limelight. You know, um, but tonight, and the reason why I know that I get the limelight is because Fazana tells me every day. She texts me every day on the phone and tells me, Fazana, you're friendly, you're so clever. You know, I'm so proud to be a sister. She tells me this every day. So, so I guess. No one in the entire world can take the limelight off her tonight. She looks absolutely beautiful, both inside So Patrick, you're a really lucky man. And I'm so proud that you're marrying my sister. And I know that you will tr truly cherish her and you will treat her well. I'm so happy that I can call you my brother and welcome to our family and good luck because I think you really need it. Yeah. So Fazana, um, I know you and Patrick have been together for a while now, but as your sister, I feel that I have the responsibility that I have to give you some good marriage advice. Even though I'm not married, so just overlook that for now. Um, so here it goes. So as my sister, you're bound to be clever. You'll always have the last word in every disagree disagreement. Yeah. But if you're very clever, every now and then you'll let, have, you'll let Patrick have his last say. Oh. Patrick, when all else fails, just remember the magic words, you're right, my darling, <laughs> and I'm sorry. Even though you don't know what you're sorry for, just say I'm sorry. <laughs> and why do I say this? And all the ladies in the audience will know because a happy wife makes a happy husband. So some more advice for you both. Take each day and cherish your time together. Love one with one, love one, with one another and take the time to talk to another. On the most serious note, on the more serious note, just for those who, who don't know that Fazara and I lost our mother a little, probably about five weeks ago. Um, Fazana, I know that mum is actually with us here right now. She would be so proud of the woman that you've actually become. Um, she would want the world of happiness for you and as well as Patrick. So here's to, so for my dad and my mum and I, so here's to the love, laughter and happily ever after for you both. So raise your glass. Yes, yay! Thank you. 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 Thank you.